my live traders nailed it today. Here's why. Hi guys, I kind of knew today, pre-market time, that TLRY is going to be my main trade today. So let's take a short recap of my trading session today. Now, I already do have one trade in TLRY and I failed. I'm down like $8,000 as you can see here. Well, I thought it's going to come down earlier. It did not. It spiked over the support, uh, the resistance level over there, took me out and now I'm planning my second trade because I keep thinking that TLRY is likely to come down today. Well, I'm looking for the point of no return now and uh, we're soon going to see what happened there. But until now, if you like this video, how about giving us a thumb up? It helps our channel, helps more people like you uh, to look for day trading videos. Now, take a look at how it came down and I'm about to short it right at the $48 mark because I think the $48 mark should be the point of no return. It's right here and I'm just moving in right now with 6,000 shares short. I'm already short. That's my second trade in TLY and I just added another 4,000 because it moved under 47.50 uh, for a short while. I thought I should add and in fact, I'm and, and I'm planning another point where I will keep on adding if it comes down under $47. So now it just touched the 47.50 really and I shouldn't have added there because I thought it's about to break down but I'm, I'm still quite confident at that point that it's going to continue coming down. We're going to discuss that a little bit later because we're going to take a look at the daily. Now take a look at uh, the trend and again once it failed to move higher as you can see right over here that's the point where it took me out. Well I did not know that it's going to stop there but once it did then I knew that it's finally going to fail. Now it's coming down and I'm about to add another 4,000 shares. Watch the buyers, watch the sellers. Once we get to the 47 mark, that's the point where I'm about to add. Just about to happen. And here we go now adding another 4,000 shares. Now I really trust the trend. At that point, it's trending lower. I mean, that's just one minute candles, but it is trending lower. And I believe that it's probably going to continue coming down. So that's the first forward, just moved under the lows. And as you can see, I'm already up around $20,000 and I'm expecting a continuation. Now, at that point, once it moved under the lows, usually I would take my partial. I did not because I was expecting it to continue coming down. That's because I did let it ride a little bit more than I usually do. Again, trusting the daily. Now you need to think, you need to think GME all over again. It's the same idea. And here we go. A new low and I'm getting ready for my partial now. You need to think GME all over again. These Reddit guys are pushing stocks especially TLRY recently and it just can't hold. That's the same idea as GME and I think we're going to get some fantastic trade in the coming year. Now that's the point where it starts to look to me like it's a bit extended to the downside, already up over $60,000 and I'm about to take my partial right here. Took. Left just 400 shares. That's it. I reached my target and a bit more. Here's the result. As you can see, after covering my $8,000 loser, I'm up $46,000. I do have another two nice trades in TAP and Riot. Now let's take it TLRY a little bit later. So you see my entry point, my initial entry point was right over here at around the $48 mark and it just kept going down as I expected. But we need to take a look at the daily. Here's the daily. The stock was recently, I'm just a few months ago at $5. Is there any justification for stock to be at $50 just like GME was at $450? Well, it's not exactly the same idea, but as you can see, it's the same result. Now, I don't know what's coming next. It could continue coming up tomorrow. I don't know and I don't care, but when the stock is so much extended, you look for the intraday opportunity to short a stock that looks like that. You gotta find the intraday opportunity. I'm not gonna go to sleep with my last 400 shares. I'm gonna close it by the end of the day because maybe tomorrow it's going to keep moving higher, which is what's happening right now to Riot, which is another stock that's being driven up by the already Robinhood traders. I did have a short opportunity today in Riot and I took it, but that happened with a small size. Now, Take a look at the daily. When the stock is moving up, gapping up as much as Riot, it's in fact likely to continue because usually the momentum takes it higher. So as you've just seen, Riot did not crash today. That's why my short size intraday opportunity was very small size. 
uh, assuming it's going to come down a bit and I just wanted to scalp this uh, small move down. I did not know if it's going to continue coming down. This could have happened. It did not. So I had a stop and now it's back to the highs and I'm expecting it in fact to continue. Well, if it doesn't, it doesn't. I'm not playing it overnight. That would be extremely dangerous to play a stock like this overnight. You just don't do it. Don't, don't try and follow this uh, ready traders wherever they are uh, unless you're just playing with extremely low size and you know just having fun with that which is also an interesting thing to do but if I'm going to find the opportunity to short Riot or uh, Mara M-A-R-A -A, watch this one as well because these talks are extremely extended now so just like what happened with Jimmy I'm going to wait for the right intraday opportunity to short these talks the intraday opportunity. I don't know when it's going to happen. I don't know at what price it's going to happen. Could Riot move just like GME to 450 or more? No idea. Probably not. But I'm going to find the opportunity in the next few days to short Riot and I'm going to find the opportunity to short Mara and maybe TLOY will continue. I don't know. Well, that's the whole idea of day trading. We make money intraday. And traders, if you like this video, and again, we would really appreciate if you give us a thumb up. It helps our channel. And uh, if you want to see more videos like this, then you can subscribe right over here. There's a button and you can click on the notification bell so you can get uh, more information when we're uploading new videos. And if you do like to trade with us, there's a link right here below, several links where you can join us for free. Join our trading room for free, join uh, more services, uh, courses and so on for free. Uh, we would really appreciate if you do that. Now, take a look at Mara. That's what I wanted to talk to you about earlier. Same idea as Riot, huge gap up, an interesting opportunity in the next few days. Uh, stay safe, stay green. I'll see you the next days.